Ladies and gentlemen, I am Mike Reverb. This is the World of Warcraft Legion Alpha, and you are about to experience firsthand what it's like to begin leveling as a demon hunter. This is my first time playing as a demon hunter. I haven't done anything with it before outside of customizing my awesome night elf demon hunter. So together we're going to explore what the starting zones are and also what the abilities are. So I'm pretty excited outside of double jumping. I have no idea what demon hunters can do. Uh, so as you can see, I have Mike reverb. I gave him some long white hair and a white beard because I'm an old man. And I also gave him the scaly skin, which I thought looked really cool. Um, as well as the big curved horns and the blindfold where the light comes out of my last video we did talk about customization options so you can take a look at that if you're interested in seeing what you can build your demon hunter into so it's interesting i start off at level 98 <clears throat> and there is a portal with bones and fell lava juice mm -hmm. looks like slurm Old school ride. Okay. I don't know what that means, but I like it. Garrus's keystone is the crux of my plan to defeat the bird. <gasps> Elodin's talking to us. It is also your only way back. Find it and return to the Black Temple. <gasps> the Black Temple. I haven't been there since the Burning Crusade. I'm not the type of guy who goes in and like runs it to get the glaives and everything else. Azeroth must not fall. Our advanced force of demon hunters is here and has engaged the Legion. Make our presence known. Let's send a shiver down every demon's spine. Plant the flag, Mike Reverb. Alright, so we get ourselves a new pair of booties. I like not that. Give in. You heard Lord Illidan. Let's find that keystone. With it. We'll be able to invade any Legion world. Okay, so we have Fell Rush. Rush forward, incinerating anything in your past for 10,018 uh, fire damage. We have Demon's Bite, which is a quick attack that causes 8,905 physical damage and generates 20 to 30 fury. And we have Chaos Strike, which is slice your enemies for 17,317 chaos damage. Critical strikes do not consume fury so critical strikes with chaos strike do not consume fury um fury is what we have to work with so it's kind of like a a rogue in that regard we don't have to actually build it up so we went forward keep in mind that i do not have my key binds rolling in the way that i usually do um so you might see a click or two like some dirty casual and I must apologize. I don't know what that is. What is that? Demon Soul dealing 20% increased damage. Nice. Alright, so it looks like two. Uh, the Demon's Bite is our Fury Builder. Which is pretty cool. And then the other one is our Fury Spender. Uh, Chaos Strike. So Demon's Bite and Chaos Strike. That's all we've got to work with for now, really. Oh, I gotta put Auto Loot on somewhere. Use up Fury. Gain it back. It's actually quite generous. The amount of Fury that you can get back is quite generous. My goodness, my Demon Hunter looks awesome by default. Kioi! Alright. Like, you don't start off looking lame, you know? You get glaives right off the bat. Actually, let me see. Sorry, guys. Uh, system... Crap, no. Is it interface? Yes. Auto loot. At least that much. What's nope. Next? We are still gonna kill this man. There we go. Mm. Delicious. Imp mother. Let's do it. 
Hey guys, I'm fucking your mom. <laughs> oh shit, I'm about to get fucked. Get out of the nasties. Not bad. Alright, there's one more ability on my bar that I didn't notice before. Spectral Sight allows you to see enemies and treasures through physical barriers as well as enemies that are stealth and invisible. That is really cool and there's only a what? A 10 second cooldown? That's uh, kind of nasty, I must say. There it is, look! That is so cool! You can see all the hidden thingies. It's too far away. I chop, I slice, I chop again. There we go, give me that increased damage. Illidan banner. Oh, Illidari banner placed. Okay. So they want me to place that over here. There we go. Can I double jump? Oh! The love. Sayana, Jace, Alari, find the keystone. Now, let's see about activating that gateway. Yes, we need to get back to the Black Temple and kiss... Illidan right on his little little purple lips. We are all that stands between the Legion and Annihilation. We must eliminate the Legion threat on this ridge so that you can bring the rest of our forces in from the Black Temple. That ought to get their attention. Now on to the business of summoning the rest of our forces. Give me the boots. 50 quests complete. Yes. Lord Illidan has placed you in charge. Now we must need, we just need the rest of our Illidari attack force. There are three burning legion gateways ahead. Activate them and our Illidari will pour through from the Black Temple. Like most legion constructs, the gateways are pr powered by souls. I think we have provided enough to activate the first one, don't you? Let us bring in our Ashtung forces. Summon in your Ash Tongue forces by activating the Legion Gateway. Will do. do not meet again. Activate all three gateways Bloop. and summon Boots. in the rest of our forces. I'll cut a hole through the demons and meet you in the vault. Ooh, I have a bonus objective to attack uh, the Legion in the Lower Lands. All right. Ash Tongue forces. Souls were sacrificed here. The activator is powered. I will Weow. move ahead and find a way. Oh! With a gift from Lord Illidan. That is so awesome. Who are these guys, though? Yours. They're obviously not demon hunters. We will assist in establishing the volcano foothold. Yes, Battle Lord Garodon. Ashton, forward! Oh, I got a fell saber! <gasps> they gave me a fell saber. Look at this guy. Are you kidding me? Look at how freaking awesome he is. Man, he's like part bone and part saber. Look at him. Find Alari in the southeast. Assault on the Morden. Yay! Those things spew fell energy, corrupting everything they touch. <laughs> Okay, nice. All right, so over there is where we have to go. Um, but for now, guys, I'm going to keep these videos kind of bite-sized and short. Um, so about 10 minutes each. I'm going to end this one right here since we got our new, uh, what is it called again? Our Fell Saber, which looks absolutely delicious, especially since it matches my Demon Hunter's markings. In the next episode, we'll continue with this quest line and see exactly what we have to do to claim this place for Illidan. I'm still trying to get my head wrapped around the lore, and I'm sure you are too. Um, thank you so much. Don't forget to like and to subscribe, and if you have any thoughts or if you have any suggestions on what you'd like to see in the next few uh, episodes of my alpha coverage, feel free to put it in the comments below. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.